This is your man Grayson Live doing some more Marvel Spider-Man Miles Morales. Uh, so we left off after the very first battle. Miles took down Rhino, and now we're gonna go meet our friend Genki. I will never get used to you doing that. Hey, look, check it. Christmas present from Spider-Man. Open it. Dude, put it on. I'll cover you. What? Never seen a guy change clothes in Central Park? Okay. How's it looking? <laughs> Whoa. That's not bad. Miles Morales, congratulations and welcome to your very first super suit. Look at that. I mean, it's not the suit that I was expecting, but yeah. Save locked. Suits can now be equipped. Come back here. You lock more Head suits. Up down for part two of this amazing gift. <laughs> this is only half of the present. What's the other half? I'll let you know when I find it. Welcome to Just the Facts with me. Your truth slinging host with the most, J. Jonah Jameson. What? Does Pete set his suits to autoplay Jameson's show? Guy's a masochist. Sad news, listeners. My Christmas charity spectacular was canceled due to mass vigilante mayhem. Gotta be something better on. <sighs> Been hearing good things about this one. Hello, I'm Danica. Art, and this is the Danny Cast, where I spotlight the people making a real difference in our city. Today's topic, uh, you know, stockbrokers, for profit colleges, the people who make internet videos autoplay. <laughs> no, obviously we're covering the Spider-Man's incredible takedown of Rhino. Subscribe, Danny Cast, <laughs> new favorite podcast. So I don't know if we uh, went over this, but they did um, they did kind of recast not not the voice. Uh, they did kind of visually recast uh, Spider-Man. So you were looking at Peter, you were kind of like, "Hey, why does he look different?" Um, I don't remember if I said this in the last episode, but yeah. So um, they made him look a little bit more like Tom Holland. Um, at least I think it was Tom Holland, and it was I think they changed him around the time. Far From Home or Homecoming came out. I think it was Far From Home. So, okay, we're going to get back into this. Sorry. Just wanted to clear that up because I know that bothered me when I first saw it. This is the place. Looks like Pete set up a lot of gear. Oh. Hey. Miles, get ready for your first holographic training challenge. These challenges are spread throughout the city. Each one focuses on a new move or technique. This one focuses on acrobatic improvisation. Get into position to start. Hollow training? Oh, I am so down. Nice. First up, air combat. Fighting the enemy on your terms is a great way to gain the advantage. Now follow up with a mid-air attack. I mean, I was kind of doing this. And now a personal favorite, the swing kick. Okay. So yeah, we need to jump. This holotech is next gen. With the right parts, but I can make it portable. Hostile combat tactics. Ooh. Melee attack sequence active. There we go. Another key spider skill, disarm it. Disarmed opponents are far less dangerous. Nice. Crazy satisfying to knock guys out with their own weapons. Total duper. Alright, yeah. This is dope. Bless Peter Parker. Now, let's 
also perform the air launch. Attacking airborne enemies is Ooh. a great method of crowd control. Plus, the sound they make are hilarious. Blast! Blast! Call that script. You guys take a turn! Yeah! Think fast. Oh. All right, I'm feeling this. More guys incoming. Heads up. Good time for some air combat. Air combat is disarming to eliminate these enemies. Combat change. Looking good, Spider Bud. Yeah, Miles. Nice. There we go. And that's the bingo. Uh oh. Blue screen of death. Tons of high tech gear we can sell. <laughs> oh crap. Spider! Take them out! Then grab the gear! You all trying to catch some hands? Yeah? Oh. Okay, let's go. <laughs> Selling this stuff off. Just so you know. This is official Spider-Man tech. Y'all are not authorized to resell. Uh oh. Finishers almost seem like they're even more brutal. There we go. That's it for the tech thieves. Now to uh -oh. fix the training sim. Colonel Panic. Well, let's try a BIOS reset. Nice. That did it. it looks like P made stealth, swinging, and combat challenges. There we Gotta go. Gotta check these out when I get a chance. Hell yeah. Oh, that's too cool. I mean, I'll be doing those kind of on my own, just so that way I've got that satisfaction of doing them. Um, like I said, I figured that we we're going to be getting some of these challenges to do on the side, basically just kind of thinking along the same lines as the previous game. Um, at least this will kind of give me something to do while I'm uh, not able to play, because let's just say like I get a couple episodes ahead in my recording... I'm not going to sit there for a week or two weeks not playing this, so... Um, yeah, I'm I'm going to want to keep practicing this. So I'll have to add this to my repertoire of like balancing between um, the Division 2, playing that for myself, and then also playing this one. The lesser extra challenges, I guess. So we'll save the story stuff for, for this whole channel. A new thwip. Hey dude, I think you should check out Roxon Plaza on your way home. I just walked by and I'm pretty sure someone's breaking in. Uh, Ooh. yeah, I'll look into it. Hey, so I want to hear more about your new spider powers. I think it's some kind of bioelectric discharge or supercharged static electricity. Ooh, we gotta name it. How about venom power? You know, because it stings. <laughs> okay, that's not bad. I'm gonna run. Plaza first, then home. Remember, Venom power. Trust me, it's gold. 
That character really reminds me of Ned from uh, the other Spider-Man movies in the MCU for now. <laughs> Because it seems like right now they kind of did a, a soft reboot to where everyone doesn't know uh, who he is. And I mean, the movie's been out long enough, so. Hey, friends. Thank you so much for telling people about this podcast. We've jumped the charts from 136 to 87. Like, uh, wow. <laughs> okay, okay. Today I'm doing a quick cast before I head downtown for my citizenship test. And I'm answering Fandy. <laughs> What's going on here? Hi there, I'm Simon Krieger, and what you're standing next to is a new form reactor. Once activated, this reactor will supply enough energy to power all of Harlem. Now, I'm sure you're thinking, Simon, how is that possible? And the answer is new form. Just one canister of this revolutionary fuel source is enough to supply Harlem with clean, safe energy for the next 500 years. Oh, shit. Soon, we'll be opening reactors throughout Manhattan and then worldwide. Get ready for a planet powered by Nuvor. Roxxon, we're here for you. What was that? Oh. Hmm. No sign of anybody. Okay. They broke a bunch of stuff. Maybe they were looking for something. Huh. They did a search for new food. Ooh. What were they gonna do with it? <laughs> Man, this night was just not quit. Hey, call me me. Their tech is unbelievable. Whoa. But Venom totally wrecked it. Yeah, Genki's right. Venom's a good name. We'll kill you. Uh, okay. <laughs> I really need to practice like more of this combat. I mean, it's really satisfying. on this and I just don't want to mess it up. I'm trying to save the uh, finisher. Oop, hello. Sounds like they're after new form. 
stuff in the reactor? It's not installed yet. You're talking about shipments. Weird. Super weird. Hey, I did that grocery shopping your mom wanted, but she's wondering where you are. The dinner's almost ready. Crap. Okay. I'll try to wrap this up. Thanks, man. Crap. Uh, we'll just take you out faster then. Okay, where's... Oh. Hello. Like lost track of where I was for a moment. Ow. Ah, there you are. There's the French in your shooter. Okay. Here, this guy. shipments. I need to figure out what they found so I know where they're gonna hit next. Um, oh. I was still supposed to be up there. Okay. They were tracking new form shipments. But why? Rock's on security. They can take it from here. Yeah. Gotta look into this later. Okay. Um, I think I we'll go. Christmas dinner sounded pretty good right about now. I'll look into that group and the new form shipments tomorrow. So I think we'll go a little bit longer. And we'll end up seeing more of this game. Um, I mean, we'll uh, we'll check and see like how the editing process kind of ends up going, uh, and also we'll see how uh, this game is received. So, um, if you guys are cool with like 30 minutes or 20 minutes, uh, by all means, let me know. Uh, so, mostly just because I enjoy watching the story kind of unfold. Um, that's what we're going to be trying to focus on. What is this? Oh, it's his backpack. It's too cold to change out here. Oh, look at that. That's cool. Okay, let's uh, go get yelled at by mom. <laughs> <laughs> Middle school graduation. Haven't seen these two in a while. Oh. Nope, I wanted to read it. Wrong button. Congrats, Miles and Phil. Or Finn? I'm gonna kick high school's you know what. Anything else in here? 
I'm just kind of snooping. Spider suit ideas. Gotta make sure mom doesn't see this. Huh. You should probably put that away, bud. Because then it's going to be like, what is this? Glad Genki stay in a couple of weeks. Gonna be a lot of late nights working on spider gear. I wonder, was Genki the one that helped him? Or were they the ones that like built that, uh, that app in the last game? <laughs> Pete took me to see this. He totally cried at the end. And so did I. What is it? Kirby Theater, Amor, Vida, in the Hanyo. Okay. Amor. That's Man. what it was. Stevie is as old as a boiler. Does not even turn on. Is it plugged in? Who knows? This move really hasn't sunk in yet. Still feels yeah. like a Abuela's apartment, not ours. Did they move in with uh, Abuela? Hey, hey, Let's hey. see what Genki's working on. Oh, Speed Nonagon. Dude needs to finish so I can play it. <laughs> Are you going to have time? Still got to box up the last of Abuela's stuff and ship it to her in Puerto Rico. Oh, that's where Abuela is. Okay. Mm, this guava sauce is great. What was that? All good. Little spill. Get it cleaned up real quick. All good. <laughs> it's all right, man. Ay, bendito. Mijo, que guapo. <laughs> Gracias, mami. I invited a guest tonight. Can you get the apartment ready? Oh, uh, maybe put on some music, set the mood? Ah, oh, Naja. Really? Your campaign manager on Christmas Eve? Well, tomorrow's rally isn't going to plan itself. Thanks for getting the apartment ready, mijo. Hello? <laughs> hey, Naja, ya nos dieron el permiso para mañana. Okay. Fifteen years in Brooklyn without a stain. Then we moved to Harlem. Might be a sign. <laughs> Maybe. Yo pensé que ya habíamos llenado esos formularios. Glad Dad's tree survived the move. Me too. He loved that little guy. Ain't no Christmas like a Brooklyn Christmas. I miss hearing him say that. Huh. See. Hmm. No records. Hey, Mom, where's Dad's vinyl? Um, should be in my room. Thanks. El dijo que? No, no, no te creo. Ese hombre está loco. Yes, ma'am. I'm just being all kinds of nosy. Como cuántos estamos esperando mañana? En serio? Wow. No puedo creer que en realidad estemos haciendo esto. Is the mystery guest Uncle Aaron? Un segundo. You know I don't want him coming around here. I just thought. Never mind. Let's talk about it later, okay? Nadja, I'm back. I thought we had already established it was a campaign manager. I mean, maybe I'm wrong. No, no huh. lo creo. Pero legalmente siempre. Oh, I saw. Uh, let's just keep going. Let's see. She said in here, right? Guess mom's not done unpacking either. <laughs> that wallpaper just screams abuela. <laughs> well, what's that? Huh. Must have gotten mixed up in the move. One of Dad's old case files. Prowler. Who's the Prowler? If you've seen... Into the Spider-Verse, we have an idea. <laughs> but maybe, maybe there's gonna be a change. Maybe there's gonna be a switch. I wonder if Dad ever caught the guy. I haven't looked through these since before City Hall. Examine. Dad's favorite album. He put this on every Sunday while he made coffee. Take. I just want to see... Nosy. And I like world building. 
He's interesting. Mom ordered like a hundred of these because the article mentioned Dad. Uh -huh. Who is the Spider-Man? If only you knew, Ma. Okay, I wonder... What's the pick, DJ? The greatest record ever? I wonder what her stance is on Spider-Man. The mom's. You didn't like jazz when I was little. That doorbell's been broken for years. Could you get that? Of course. Finn? Hey. Fixed your doorbell. <laughs> it's so good to see you. How are you? It's been like... Months. A lot's changed. Yeah, it really has. Is that our guest of honor? Come on in, you two. Dinner's almost ready. Finn, I'm so glad you could make it. Thanks for inviting me, Miss Morales. <laughs> we missed you. Well, this one especially. <laughs> uh, hi. Finn, this is Genki, my friend from Brooklyn Visions Academy. Genki? This is Finn, my best friend, <laughs> my other best friend. <laughs> oh yeah, you guys won the middle school science fair at County, right? You made a, uh... Energy, energy converter? converter? Jinx! <laughs> <laughs> oh. <sighs> the wiring in this building is such a mess. I'll check the circuit breaker. So, Christmas Are we gonna use our new powers? I promise I didn't Kinda break it your doorbell. No good. Breaker doesn't have power. Uh -oh. Let me check if I can see anything from the fire escape. Okay, honey, but be safe. What's gonna lead here? Definitely can't get to the transformer from here, unless you're super sticky. <laughs> Really hope no one can see me up here. Don't look out the window. Don't look out the window. Think Seriously. Any luck outside? Hot plates are only going to get us so far in salvaging this dinner. Bioelectricity can take down Rhino, but can it save Christmas dinner? It's a very good question. Silent night, freezing night. Come on. It worked. Hey. Oh, man, those lights are bright. Did not think this through. Gotta get back inside ASAP. Um, nobody can see me. Nobody can see me. Nobody better be able to see me. Come on, Genki. Is Miles still outside? Actually, uh, what about a photo? <laughs> right now? Yeah, you know. Precious moments. You gotta capture them. Shouldn't we wait for Miles? No, he hates photos. <laughs> All right, everyone squeeze in. Ready? Great photo, great photo. Oh, hey, Miles. Uh, who's ready to eat? You guys sit down. I got this. Mm, smells good. Mm. Tell us everything you've been up to. You still in robotics club? I had to quit, but I've been studying biotech on my own. Nerd. Ugh. 
says the guy who has to wear an ascot to school. <laughs> hey, only on Tuesdays. <laughs> Does your brother Rick still work for Roxanne? I don't know how anyone could work there after seeing your last campaign ad. You went for Simon Krieger's jugular. <laughs> that reminds me. Genki, you have a certain flair for social media. Could you spread the word about tomorrow's rally? Yeah, we'll be trending by midnight. <clears throat> Sometimes it feels like Simon Krieger's my real opponent. Roxanne has so much influence here, but they don't answer to anyone except their shareholders. Harlem needs someone to fight for the community. That's Mom's campaign speech voice, in case you couldn't tell. <laughs> uh, you want to proofread these before I post them? Yes! Do not hit send! <gasps> <laughs> So, what's going on with you? What do you mean? You seem... I don't know. Distracted. Wanna talk about it? Not tonight. It's Christmas. Hey, how are you handling the move from Brooklyn? I mean... It's fine. Ugh. You hate it. No. That's your, I hate it, but I'm too nice to say it voice. No. It's... I don't know anybody here, and I'm always having to ask for directions. You need to find a good restaurant, a barber shop, somewhere you can shoot hoops. You'll settle in. What if we hang out tomorrow? Just the two of us. You're not too busy? It's winter break. I can put off homework for at least another week. <laughs> okay, I'll text you. It's a date. No. I, I mean, N not a date, uh, you know, a, a friend date. Still as smooth as the last time I saw you. <laughs> Miles. What? You awake? No. So I stayed up last night and designed an app for your new suit. Thing's got a crazy custom OS, nothing I've ever seen before. But I ran it through a disassembler so I could reverse engineer the plugin architecture and. Uh... You just fell asleep again, didn't you? Miles! I'm up. I'm up. <laughs> it's almost done compiling. Oh, thank you. Ready to try out my app? Yeah, man. Let's do this. I'm connected to your analytics. Let's test drive this baby. All right. I can see everything you see. How are you not puking all the time? Lots of practice. Oh, uh, friendly neighborhood Spider-Man app. Okay, swipe left. Welcome to Friendly Neighborhood 1.0. It lets New Yorkers directly request your help and report crimes in progress. Nice UI. Oh. Thanks. Oh, look, someone just made a request. Trains out of service. Request came from a guy named Aaron Davis. Wait, what? That's my uncle. Does he know you're Spider-Man? No. Gotta be a coincidence. I'm headed to the subway stop. Okay, well, um, this episode has gone on pretty long. Uh, I'll see if there's any spot that I can possibly edit, but uh, I'm gonna try and leave everything in. So hopefully you're enjoying yourselves. This is, of course, Marvel Spider-Man Miles Morales 4, PlayStation 5. The subways in Harlem. I have been Grayson. So, um, if you're enjoying yourselves, you can, of course, do the whole like, comment, subscribe thing. I'd greatly appreciate it. And until then, I will see you around. So, again, take care of yourselves. Take care of each other.